day she tries to seduce Adonis, young huntsman. The story starts at sunrise, when she flags Adonis down from his horse. She's a bit abrasive, and actually drags the lad from his mouth. She ties up the stallion, and proceeds to wrestle Adonis to the ground, but he breaks free. and a lengthy diatribe on love's attributes, Adonis becomes exhausted and returns to his pale fray. There's only one problem. His stallion is made off with a runaway breeding mare, and despite Adonis's efforts, cannot be recovered. for the loss and bids her to leave. Heartbroken at his rejection, Venus tries a gentler tactic and begs him for just one kiss. So now the day is spent, so he agrees to kiss her as long as she will say goodbye and allow him to return home. Venus, having tasted such sweet fruit, hungers for more and has to see Adonis the next day. Adonis explains he cannot as he is expected by his friends to hunt the boar. When Venus hears that he's gone boar hunting, she cries out and begs him not to. She says that she fears for his life and that surely he will die. But yes, I think boars are quite um, ravenous, really. I have no idea what this scene is. Hang on a second. After spending the night worried about Adonis and alone, she hears the hunting horn and rushes to him. Arriving at the Barking Hounds, she shortly discovers Adonis's body gored to death by the boar. And it is at that 